Hello to all my friends out there. So I wasn't planning on buying any meat tonight, but I went to get some, uh, I thought, what kind of drinks can I get that don't have caffeine because, uh, or lots of sugar, like the tea I've been drinking. So I came up with this one. Uh, I'm gonna try this. Uh, still, I have to drink some tea with sugar because I don't want to go back to my uh, Coke habit, Diet Coke habit. So anyway, I was went there uh, to get some diet drinks. And then I wanted to mention, I fill my water up at the kiosks for 35 cents. So that way I get bottled water and uh, I only have to pay 35 cents if I refill my uh, water bottle. So, okay, here's what happened. I saw they had the chickens marked down, and so I like to buy 10 pounds chicken, 10 pounds hamburger, and 10 pounds something else, any assortments of meat. So I'm buying 30 pounds a month. And so I try to find them as close to a dollar as I can, and I thought, wow, these look like a good deal. I'm just gonna buy these because I will cut them up. There's my 10 pounds of um, chicken. Boom, I'm done. So I was going to make a burrito, but I remembered I had this uh, hamburger left from the tacos. And if you remember, I, um, I, um, I saved a little bit, maybe like a quarter, well, probably about a third pound. And I think I'm going to buy this um, beef at um, 99 cent only because it was $3 a pound. And this is really good. And if you go to um, other stores and you look at the price of this uh, ground beef, it's a lot more than $2.99. Okay, and these were on sale for $1 at Ralph's. So I thought, well, I'll buy one of these to go with my uh, beef. You know, when you have a tiny bit of uh, meat left. Okay, so this month, I, I'm going to keep a uh, running total of my um, meat so you guys can see, you know, someone said they would like a budget. I'm just totally cheap. I don't really do a budget, but um, okay, so I got 11.83 pound, pounds, so figure 12 pounds, and it cost me $15.00. So, well, figure $16, so 134 pounds. So I knew it's pretty close to the, um, the $1 a pound. So I thought, okay, that'll do. So I have now have the 10 pounds chicken, and then it's important to see what's left in the freezer. And as you can see, I have, I, this was a 10 pound ham. I think I probably got about five pounds left. A couple hot dogs were rolling around there and one of these uh, chopped beef uh, steaks. So I did pretty good eating all my um, meat up before buying uh, more. So what I do is I keep all the meat that I have left over on the right hand side of the um, freezer and I put the new meat on the left hand side of the freezer. And uh, so, you know, when you buy your food by the month, it's still cheaper because uh, I think I uh, bought very little food last month and I still have five, about five or six pounds of meat left. So uh, I'm going to try to find, well, I am going to buy 30 pounds of meat. And the next thing I'm going to buy is uh, 10 pounds of this ground beef at 99 cent only. Okay, you guys, I will be back soon with some beef stroganoff. Oh, and I bought some cheese uh, that was marked down one pound for three dollars and forty something cents at Ralph's. So that is about the rock bottom uh, price for a pound. So um, I need about two pounds a month. So I'll probably buy another one of those. I'll show you when I come back with the beef stroganoff. And God bless you all.